Here, dinosaurs do not rule. Instead, giant marine reptiles have evolved, perfectly adapted to life in these beautiful waters. All of them are air breathers, like this eight-ton Cryptoclidus. On the land, they are cumbersome hulks. But in the water, they are transformed. sea reptiles once lived on land, but 75 million years ago, the ancestors of these creatures took to the water and their legs became graceful flippers. Most other marine reptiles, like Cryptoclidus, use all four flippers to chase the blizzards of fish through the water. Flapping like underwater wings, these flippers can be used separately to give them enormous maneuverability, or together for sudden bursts of speed. This unique method of locomotion is destined to disappear from the ocean at the end of the age of the dinosaurs. The animals on the small islands above also depend on the sea's bounty for their survival. Having a lung full of air presents all marine reptiles with a buoyancy problem. Cryptoclidus has found one solution. He is not searching for food in the sand. He is, in fact, after pebbles and grit. Sieving off the fine grains, he retains the larger stones in his stomach for ballast, which weighs him down and counteracts the air in his lungs. The land represents safety for the Cryptoclidus. With the high tide, they have come up onto the rock ledges to rest and also to be out of reach of Lyplurodon.